welcome back to my channel my name is Sinead and if you're new here I do a lot of Disney related stuff so please subscribe if that sounds like your cup of tea so I haven't done a video in a while just because I've not been feeling very well but I feel a lot better today so I really wanted to share with you the things that I got for Christmas though this isn't to brag or to show off or anything like that I think that coming up to Christmas what a lovely thing to do is to like volunteer or donate to your favourite little charities and stuff, which I did throughout the month of December. I link the ones, they're all animal related. Sorry, but that's just my thing. Um, I'll link them in the description in case you want to check them out. But anyway, I love watching these type of videos, partly because I'm nosy, partly because I love Disney. So yeah, let me share with you what I got. It's mainly Disney stuff. Shock. So Kevin got me, like he went above and beyond this Christmas. I got him a lot of lovely stuff too, don't get me wrong, we spoiled each other, but I feel like I got extra spoiled. Um, so he got me a lounge fly first of all, and I would have never thought that he would pick this lounge fly, and when I opened it, I was like, I'm in love with it. So it's the Maleficent Villains Lounge Fly Backpack, and I really, really adore this. I Like I said, I was not expecting it at all, and when I opened it, it just, it was perfect. It is so cool. Now, one of her horns there on her crown is a little bit wonky because of the packaging, but that's fine, we'll we'll sort that out. But look at her gorgeous eye detail. And then her beautiful red nails on her fingers there, which has inspired me to definitely get that color red next time I get my nails done. And then we have Aurora here in the front, which is just such a beautiful, beautiful piece there in the front on the pocket. This bag is actually quite big too. Or maybe that's just in my head because it is a mini backpack, but it just looks big. It's really, really beautiful. And yeah, just so, so delighted with it. The colors are like a gray lavendery kind of color on the, the detail in there and then the lovely black. And I love a black plaque on a lounge fly bag. Then I haven't actually taken down the straps yet or anything because this is a gorgeous bag, but it's quite extravagant. It's quite look at me kind of thing. So this is mainly for any Disney holidays that I go on, like our hopefully still scheduled, depending on coronavirus honeymoon in March. So I'm just really, really delighted with this and I will rock this in the park. I think it's gonna be perfect. Um, you know, this means that I'll have to get some Maleficent ears. So, of course. So this is the backpack that I got and I'm really delighted with it. And just the straps have the thorn detail from the scene where Maleficent is a dragon. I think that's an awesome detail. That's my backpack. And then the next thing is a plush that Kevin got for me. Now, again, this is something that I didn't think he'd ever pick out, but I was so, so happy with it when I saw it. And it's a Binks Hocus Pocus plush. Isn't it gorgeous? I love his lovely green eyes. And the hat, so the hat is Danny's hat, which is adorable that they put Danny's hat on him. And look at that polka dot bow. Isn't it beautiful? A ribbon. Really, really happy with this. I th I just, I love it. And he's got his little Binks collar. If in the future, I always say this, so I think this is why Kevin got this for me. If in the future I'm able to have dogs that like cats, I will definitely be adopting two black cats if I can. Binks and Salem. That's going to be their names. So this is, I guess this is substituting that or one of them for the time being. So next he got me this really cute key ring or key chain, depending on how you say it. It's Max Goof as Powerline. Now I've seen this on Shop Disney and I really wanted to do an order and add this to it, but he got there ahead of me. So this is such a cute key chain. A Goofy movie is probably in like my top 10 Disney movies, definitely like underrated Disney movies and it has the best Disney soundtrack or one of the best Disney soundtracks of all time, my opinion. So I'm really, really happy with this keyring and it's a really good size too. It's really cool. So that's the keychain. So the next things that I got from Kevin are two wallets. So it's really going with a bag wallet travel theme because of our honeymoon. And he got me these fantastic wallets. So the first one that he got me is this really beautiful cat one or kitten one. And when I first opened it, at first glance, I thought it was the three kittens from the Aristocats. Um, but it's actually got Oliver and Figaro on there with Marie, which I'm not mad at. I love Berlioz and Toulouse, but I love, these are like my, my three favorite Disney cats. So 
yeah i'm really really happy with this and it's a lovely gray color but then it actually has a really lovely lavender detail where the gray plaque is and then on the inside it's got that lavender color as well i think that's super pretty and i love a good disney purse and i'm always switching off my purses because you, know, you don't always want to take a bag with you sometimes you just take a purse and i want as many disney purses and wallets as i can get my hands on it's a good thing that i also have the disney dog one it's a really unexpected combination of disney dogs which is why i think i love it even more so it's got lucky lady and pluto and this color blue is one of my favorite colors this like powdery baby blue i think it's really retro looking i don't know why i just really do and then the black mixed with it and that gorgeous baby blue plaque on the back of the purse that was a lot of kind of rhyming. I think they really go well together. And it's black on the inside. And like, that looks super retro to me. I don't know. I just think it's lovely. That's my two new wallets that I'll be rocking around. So if that wasn't enough, which it would have been, Kevin also got me something that I never would have expected to get. And I've always seen in other like Disney YouTubers, like kind of bigger Disney YouTubers videos. And I've always thought they were so gorgeous. Never thought I'd have one, but he went ahead and surprised me and got me a Dooney and Burke bag. Ah. So this is a Dooney and Burke tote bag. It is massive. It is so spacious and so gorgeous. I haven't, I just took it out of the plastic again. I haven't really, well, I don't intend to take this too many places, just kind of special places. And of course, this will be on the plane with me if we get to go in March. Um, and that's because... I don't want to do any damage to it like I tend to damage some things so this is really really beautiful and the pattern on it is like a retro or vintage classic Mickey and Minnie which is my favorite ever version of Mickey and Minnie just love it and then they also have different symbols for the park on there for I'm guessing Disneyland California we have the teacup ride we have the little Mickey ear hat and the carousel the castle it's just such beautiful detail and i love the color i love pink i'm just obsessed with it and it's massive too it's so spacious on the inside see i haven't even taken this i don't intend to as yet um and it's got a lovely red interior with the brown leather really beautiful and it has the dooney and burke if you can see the dooney and burke plaque on there i'm just dying about it i was trying to look at the label um but it just says i was trying to see if it has a name but it just says dooney and burke it's really really beautiful so couldn't but you want to see that like you couldn't the smile on my face and the tears and then kevin also got these ears that i'm wearing for me Um, so these are haunted mansion ears they are so super cool i really love them they've got madame miota like classic madame miota in the middle of it and Haunted Mansion is our favourite ride at Walt Disney World, our like, combined favourite ride. Just can't wait to, to go on it again in the future. So really, really happy with these ears. And they have a really, really beautiful like thick velvet bow, which has some cool pins in it. And they have some studs on them too, which make them like real cool. So yeah, love these ears. These are the, the other thing that Kevin got for me that I'm so happy with. So, yeah, really spoiled. But like I said, I did spoil him too. I feel like he maybe spoiled me a little bit more. So most of my family and stuff got me gift cards, which I really, really love. Um, my, my granny and my mother gave me money to buy a microwave because I needed a new microwave. And they got me like chocolates and wine and stuff. And then my sister gave me gift cards. So my niece and nephew actually got me two bottles of perfume, which was so good of them. So they got me Lancome Miracle, which is more like kind of, you know, an evening perfume to me. I have it in my bag at the minute. But then they also got me my favorite daytime perfume, which is Barbary Touch. I really love this perfume. So thank you so much, darlings. And then they also got me this Ariel doll. So this I was really wanting. This is Ariel in her bridal dress, as you can see. And this is the new dolls that Shop Disney put out this year. I love the Shop Disney dolls recently. I got a few last year and obviously got this one this year. And oh my God. I think they're stunning. So here she is in all her glory. Oh, don't fall down, Ariel. Here she is in all her glory and she's got her beautiful wedding dress on. I do appreciate that they didn't do the full 80s sleeve. 
like they could have. They just gave us a little 80s poof of sleeve there. And she's got, it's not a dingle hopper, but she does have her hairbrush, which is really, really pretty there. And I'm not going to open this because I already opened it and I feel like I'm going to mess with it if I do. And I won't be taking her out of the box. But if you open that out, you can see her full dress. But you can see it on the front. She's just, look at her face. And you know, Ariel's my favourite. So, so happy with this. I think the packaging on this is really beautiful as well. So, yeah, I actually got two really beautiful Disney calendars. So... Kevin's family gave us like lovely vouchers and a restaurant voucher for a night out and stuff and he got some aftershave and things like that off them and they also gave me this really adorable Disney family calendar which I've never seen before actually and I'm so so happy with it it's a really good organizer calendar so I have to I have no excuse not to be organized when I've got this and then another calendar and um I just love the blue polka dots on it and the whole colour scheme. It feels very retro, which you know I love. So February actually, which is my birthday month, has Lady and the Tramp on it too. So yeah, really, really happy with this calendar. And my cousin got me a Disney calendar too. And this one I'm super excited about because it's a Thomas Kincaid and I've never had a Thomas Kincaid calendar. And I know a lot of people, in particular Disney Matt um, here on YouTube and on Instagram. I know that Matt has a Thomas Kincaid calendar from 2021 at least that he always shows the different artwork each month on his Instagram. And I'm so happy that I have one now too. Maybe he has this one as well. And it has Aladdin on the front. It's absolutely beautiful. Like his artwork is stunning. Look at Raja so cute sorry about the glare from this ring light it's ireland and it's like mid-afternoon and it's nearly dark but so yeah a really really beautiful calendar i love disney calendars and i'll be i have no excuse not to be organized with two calendars and my cousin also got me a bottle of jack daniels which i'm sorry to anyone who doesn't drink but jack daniels is the nectar of the gods like frank sinatra said and this one i've never actually tried before it's tennessee honey and I am so looking forward to trying this this evening. It's New Year's Eve and we've no plans, just us and the pups at home, like last year. And you know what? I'm so happy about it. And we're gonna have some whiskey. And then I love Big Jar Candles. She also got me this vanilla Big Jar Candle. And it, it smells so good. But these scented candles that smell like cookies and vanilla and stuff always make me hungry. Thanks so much Aoife for the whiskey and the candle and the calendar. Really, really happy with all those. And then speaking of whiskey, we are really well stocked because my uncle got us a set of whiskey glasses, which have been used already over Christmas. So they're in my cupboard, but they're really cute. And he also got us classic bottle of Jack, my fave. So yeah, really, really delighted with the, I've stocked up for the whiskey for the next one. As I was saying, everyone else kind of got me gift cards. It gave me money towards things. So I was really, really happy with that. And I really hope you enjoyed seeing what I got for Christmas. Let me know if you got anything similar or let me know if you have a video up of what you got because I'd love to watch it. Um, and I really hope you enjoyed seeing what I got. And I hope that you have a really happy new year and that we have a really good year in 2022. Thanks so much for watching. Take care. <laughs>